So, hear me out. What if Jordan Peele directed a new Planet of the Apes movie? Thank you. That is all I require. The recent Planet of the Apes trilogy ended in a very familiar way. The last shot of War for the Planet of the Apes was Caesar dying in front of a group of intelligent apes that have just survived being enslaved by humans inside of an army base. They reach the oasis and is bound to raise a new colony of apes in the years or centuries to come. What does this shot look like to you? If you've watched the original Planet of the Apes movies, you'll notice that this desert location looks a lot like where the very first Planet of the Apes movie started on. Come on. <laughs> now, here's the pitch. The original Planet of the Apes movie starred Charlton Heston and was directed by Franklin J. Schaffner. But what you really need to know is that the screenplay for the first film was written by Michael Wilson and Rod Serling. Rod Serling was the creator of The Twilight Zone. How do you do? The narrator in each episode and wrote about 92 episodes within 156 in the whole series. Because this is my medium and I understand it. I'm a dramatist for television. This is the area I know. I've been trained for it. I've worked for it for 12, in it for 12 years. He was the backbone of that series and his style in writing gave him the opportunity to be chosen as a screenwriter for the Planet of the Apes film that was to be adapted from a novel of the same name by Pierre Boulle. In today's Twilight Zone reincarnation, the new narrator of the series is none other than Jordan Peele, who came from making comedy sketches on Comedy Central to making a shift in his career by making horror movies such as Get Out, Get Out! and Us. We're Americans. And now entering the world of the Twilight Zone franchise. The next logical step here is to have him write a screenplay for a new Planet of the Apes movie. If you rewatch Get Out, you'll notice that the plot and the premise of the story alone already sounds like a Twilight Zone episode. Because most Twilight Zone episodes tackle social commentary and allegorical situations leading up to great plot twists that really stick with you even after watching it. Jordan Peele really knows how to capture that spirit in his work already. Just look at some of the sketches they made in King and Peele. You'll see a significant amount of influence, if not homage, for classical episodes of The Twilight Zone, such as Nightmare at 20,000 Feet. And other various themes spread throughout the horror series. Jordan Peele is, I think, one of the best, if not the best choice, for a new Planet of the Apes movie. He could write it or direct it, either one is okay with me. Hell, he could even play a role in the movie if he's up for it. He's got that vibe in him whenever he plays the role of the narrator. Some can arguably say that his presence alone in any of the new Twilight Zone episodes is already an eerie feeling on its own. So yeah, that's the pitch. It's just plain and simple. Put Jordan Peele's name in a new Planet of the Apes movie, if they're actually making a new one. Well, la di da. <laughs> Mama, I've got a feeling that I'm onto something. Here's a bonus pitch. Have Christian Bale as the lead character of this new Planet of the Apes movie. He's played Moses before. You know why that's relevant? Because Charlton Heston also played Moses. When I think back and I check myself. 